Good afternoon, folks. Big Bo here with another great diesel motorhome value from Parkway RV Center. Folks, I'm about to list a legend. The Newmar Corporation Dutch Star. 2000 model, 3858 with one slide out. This is a diesel motorhome in just excellent condition. Now, folks, those of you who know Newmars know that they're one of the best brands you can buy. They're, they've been around for since 1968. They only build high-quality motorhomes now. Uh, they're one of the things they're known for inventing is the one of the things everybody takes for granted. That is the slide out. They actually invented the slide out and was the first company to put them on Class A motorhomes. Folks, Newmar concentrates more on quality than quantity. They don't have the production of say Forest River, Four Winds, or places like that, but they build a superior unit in less numbers. That's why when you look online, you're going to look at a hundred of the other brands for one Newmar. And once you own a Newmar, you'll never go back. Uh, very, very well insulated, R11 insulation all the way around. This is the ultimate winter camper because it can handle whatever you, whatever you want to put on it. Onan generator runs great, powering everything on the RV, all fiberglass interior, exterior, including a no maintenance fiberglass roof. Uh, they actually build their frames like in copying residential homes with aluminum studs every 16 inches. I mean, these are great looking RVs and that's why when you even see one like this, it's a 2000 model, it looks better than most of the 2008 and 2009 models of the cheaper, less quality brands. Look at this big fiberglass cap right here. This eliminates straight edges where most leak problems occur. I mean, this thing's like punching a brick wall. Very, very well made. This came out of the Memphis, Tennessee area, so it's a southern motor home. It's got that big 300 horsepower Cummins diesel, and it's got that legendary Freightliner XC chassis and I'm gonna tell you that's very very important because the Freightliner is the most popular chassis out there and there's not a diesel shop in America that cannot work on a Freightliner chassis. Now you get some of these oddball chassis that, that are out there in, in these year models and you may have a little hard time finding somebody to service them but this Freightliner is something anybody can work on. I mean, that's the most popular motorhome chassis in existence. It's got the Allison 3000 transmission. This unit's only got 91,000 miles. And folks, for a diesel, that's considered low mileage because you can run seven or 800,000 miles on one of these and still drive it anywhere. Look at these big semi-trucks towing 60, 70,000 pounds with their Cummins engines with over a million miles on them and still going on the road every day. And this motorhome right here weighs a lot less than what they tow behind the big trucks. So I promise you folks, you'll never wear this machine out and it's priced to sell. I mean, this is the lowest price 2000 model Dutch Star 3858 on the internet. And who says you have to go out and spend sixty, seventy thousand dollars $70,000 to get a nice high quality diesel motorhome used when you can buy this one for under forty? Just a great looking RV. The tires look good. It's got the door awning, a Lumigar door and patio awning, window awnings. The whole interior, the whole basement is storage. All heated. All your plumbing's in the basement with the heat so you don't have to worry about it freezing. It's got a power step and let's take a look inside. I'm going to tell you, when you look at this RV, you have to constantly remind yourself that this is a 2000 model for under $40,000 because you feel like you're in one that's a lot newer for about twice the amount of money. Beautiful interior, folks. I mean, this thing's gorgeous. All leather furniture, uh, so sleeper sofa, sofa, ceramic tile floor, deep plush carpeting. Up here in the front, of course, you've got the TV. Backup camera works great. Hydraulic leveling jacks. CD stereo. It's got that Allison 3000 six-speed push-button automatic that... It actually learns your driving habits as you use it, and um, uh, actually uh, it takes you to a couple of thousand miles, but it'll actually adjust itself to your driving pattern, because everybody drives RVs different. The glass is perfect, the dash is perfect, everything works, folks. 
Uh, I'm gonna tell you, it's got the padded headliner that really helps reduce road noise and, and vibrations when you drive down the road. It's got a sofa right here, three people can sit on very comfortably. It's a sleeper sofa, table and chairs. You know, Dutch Star has their own Amish cabinet shop. These are all solid hardwood Amish built cabinets built just for Newmar. That's why people who buy new Mars pretty much stick with them for life because they are built so much better than most other brands out there. You've got day-night shades and all the windows. Notice none of them's messed up. Seems like most RVs you look at with the day-night shades, people kind of let them go and, and they break a string on them or bust them, but everyone in here looks great. The upholstery just looks like brand new. There's no smoke, no pet odors. And folks, when you buy an RV from us, uh, after you purchase it, we take it to our shop. We spend a few days on it. We go through this thing front to back, top to bottom, make sure everything works. But I promise you folks, just from me being out here, running the generator, the fridge, turning the lights on, I don't see anything on here that doesn't work. I even had the furnace on earlier and it's, it's nice and hot. Corian countertops. And this is a sign of a well-built coach because most RV manufacturers just cheap out and put the Corian countertops put a hole for the sink and put a stainless steel sink in it that's separate and you have a seam you have to worry about leaking and sealing all the time but not Numar. Seamless built-in Corian sinks even in the bathroom has a seamless built-in Corian sink. They don't cut corners of course these things they're they're about hundred seventy thousand dollars new in 2000. Today they're well over 225 and they still build the Dutch Star today. It's one of the best selling brands they've ever made. Like I said really nice cabinetry work in here. It's got the LP stove top. It's got the microwave confection oven and I like this. I actually put one of these in my Winnebago uh, because it's really neat because you know, you, you drive all day to get to where you're going. You get set up at the campground. Last thing you want to do with is, is go out and eat or, or call and order a pizza. You want something good to eat. You don't want to mess with the grill or getting your propane or charcoal out. Well, this right here, folks, you can throw a hamburger on there, a steak, a piece of fish, chicken, whatever you want. And it grills it in just a few minutes and does a great job. And you just take this plate out and clean it. I mean, I use ours all the time, you know, just for a quick meal for one or two people. Ceramic tile floor. It's got the air ride air suspension, which has got a great chassis because it, and here's a trick too, folks. When you look at a motor home like this, especially an older one, like a 2000 model, look at the ceramic tile. If the chassis got issues or it's got shocks issues, you're going to see a lot of busted ceramic tile. This one here, everything looks brand new, look like it did from the factory. Somebody's really kept this RV up. Uh, refrigerator has got the Dometic. Of course, it's been on for about an hour, and it's already ice cold. I mean, there's six degrees. I don't think there's any doubt that that's not working, but, and we will check it on LP operation too. And we're blowing, yeah, it's 39 degrees in the, in the fridge, so. You know, folks, we guarantee everything to work when you buy an RV. My RV techs, like I said, they go over this thing top to bottom. I've got techs that have been certified for well over 20 years, and they're going to treat it like they were buying it themselves, and they're really going to check it out good, make sure everything down to every last light bulb works perfectly. Uh, Corian sink, and like I said, again, seamless built-in sink. They didn't cheap out on that. It does have hookups for a washer and dryer. Now I can get you a washer and dryer and put in here for about $1,500. Those of you who watch my videos know I don't like them. They're a service nightmare. That's one of those things that I've seen do massive damage if they ever have a leak, do massive damage to the floor of the RV. I don't like them. Uh, they're slow. You know, you can go to Washateria and do five house load sides of clothes sizes of clothes and the time it takes one of those washers and dryers to do a pair of jeans and two shirts because that's all they'll hold but if you do have a need for one folks we will put you one in a brand new one for 1500 and that's if you buy the rv of course i couldn't sell one off the street to somebody for that cheap but a uh, private water closet uh porcelain rv toilet you know really even neat how they design this i mean they even put a water pump switch in here in the toilet closet so that way, if you forget to flip it on and, and you know, you're stuck on the toilet, you don't have to have somebody 
go outside turn the water pump switch on so you can flush your toilet you just reach behind you and flip it on so that's a kind of a neat thing of course we're not really level so these doors take a little bit to close got a really nice shower right here it's got the etched glass and this is good heavy glass that's going to resist shattering uh surround abs surround it's got a skylight looks great in here and you've got privacy doors so you can separate the bedroom and bathroom area from the rest of the rv you know if you need to for privacy we're going to walk toward the back here and this is pretty amazing folks it's still got the original factory bedding that looks great uh got the nice light fixtures it's got a residential style ceiling fan uh, TV in here. I've got both TVs on. All fluorescent lighting throughout the entire RV. I mean, even the nice uh, molding and the Wayne's board. In it. I mean, this is a nice motorhome, folks. This isn't a cheap one. And when you buy a used RV, I know saving money is important, important, but when you get into one in this price range, you want to make sure it's a well-built unit. You buy these cheap coachmans and four winds and stuff like that folks they fall to pieces when they get 10 or 12 years old i believe me i say i don't see them when they're new i see them when they get about this age right here and that's why when you go to our website or you come on our lot you're only going to see nicer brands like new mars monaco's holiday ramblers winnebago's atascas uh you're only going to see the better brands because that's the ones that our customers prefer they hold up better and you know we look at the long-term investment in you as a customer when we sell you an rv we want you to use it and enjoy it for several years and when you're ready to go to something else we still want it to be in nice enough shape that you can trade it in and we can sell it again to somebody i mean you know a lot of my rvs out here i've sold two or three four or five years ago and traded back for because the people's needs changed and they decided to go to something different and folks, that's what we look at when we look at you as a customer. We want your business for life, not just for one sale like these corporate dealers do. And folks, I'm going to tell you, we have the lowest prices on the internet. This unit's only $39.9 with everything guaranteed to work. Uh, NADA, that's $10,000 under current NADA. And these 2,038.58s online, and I've got some printouts in here, are selling for up to $74,000. I'm only asking $39.9. Here's the current NADA. No options. Freightliner chassis, $38.58. Uh, look at this, folks. $45,450. That's no options. That's not including a lot of the extras in here. With options, which there's not a lot, but it brings it up to $49,175. Again, I'm not asking $49,175. I'm asking $39.9. And be honest with you, Clean diesel motorhomes like this bring well over book, as I'm about to show you. Here's some printouts, and this is what I do every morning, folks. When I get ready to shoot one, I go through the internet and I do printouts from other dealers' websites, from RV Trader, RVT, all the different sources I can find to see what other dealers are asking for the same make and model. And I like to show those in my video because I just don't want to say we have the lowest prices on the internet. I want to prove it to you. Look here, folks, 2038.58 in Venice, Florida. And the bad thing about Florida units is you've got rust, you've got sun fading, and a lot of people stay away from them. Of course, it kind of cut off right there, but it's 47,900, and it's got, it's got 3,000 miles less than this one, and it's almost $10,000 more. Here is one in Alvarado, Texas. Same thing, a 38.58. Same motor, same chassis with 80,000 miles, 49.9. And this is straight off the RV trader. In other words, if you get on your computer and you Google 2000 model or 2000 Dutch Star 3858, you're gonna pull up the same RVs I'm showing you here. Here's one in Idaho, and of course, I, it's off a dealer's website and I blacked out their names and everything because I don't wanna make anybody mad. Uh, 2,038.58, uh, 38.51, I didn't even realize that. This is a smaller one, 49.995. Now, here's one in, of course, this one's got lower miles, 
but a diesel mileage really doesn't matter because it's going to hold up. 2000 Newmar Dutch Star in Winter Garden, Florida. Look, this is no, I can't make this stuff up, folks. $74,900. Now, I don't know about you, but when I look at fifty to $75,000, what I can buy for $39,900 at somewhere else, it's kind of a no-brainer. When I look at the NADA of $9,000 plus more than what I can buy the RV for, you know, like I said, it's kind of a no-brainer that this is the lowest priced one on the internet. It's only $39,900, and you can look all this up for yourself, folks. I prefer somebody who's done their research, who looks up what other RV dealers are look, uh, looking at, that pulls the NADA up themselves and see for themselves what what it is compared to what we're asking. I prefer everybody do that before they ever even call us because I want you to understand that we've been doing this for over 47 years. Family owned and operated since 1968, which ironically is a year, is a year that Newmar Corporation started building RVs. You know, we've been doing this a long time. We sell over 500 used RVs a year. As I'm shooting the video, there's probably 10 or 12 car loads of customers in our lot going through our RVs. And I sell all over the country. I've sold in all 50 states, including multiple sales to Alaska and Hawaii. I've sold thousands of RVs all over Canada. I've sent several RVs to Australia. In fact, I'm getting ready to send one now uh, to the shipper. I've sold them to England, Italy, the Netherlands. I've sent them all over the world, folks. And these buyers didn't come thousands of miles to us just because we had very, very clean RVs and they liked us. Of course, we're easy to get along with. The reason why they came that far away to us is because they can't beat our prices and we're saving them thousands of dollars. You can fly into Chattanooga, Tennessee Airport, which is 10 miles from us, for a few hundred dollars even just from California and we can pick you up for free during business hours bring you back here and you you know you the RV you picked out online will be ready for you and you can drive it home we'll give you a complete demo show you how to operate everything we'll give you a starter kit with all your hoses uh, RV 101 DVD and like I said my RV techs will spend hours with you if that's what it takes to show you how to operate everything on the RVs and show you everything works. I mean, we're very, very easy to get along with, and you just cannot beat the Parkway price, especially not for the quality coach you're getting in this Newmar. I mean, this isn't a coachman, folks. This is a Dutch Newmar Dutch Star, top of the line, a hundred and sixty-something thousand dollars new, fifteen years ago. You imagine what they are now, and just a super nice, clean RV, something that you can use for a couple of years. You can put 39.9 right back on it in a couple of years. If it's in this kind of condition, sell it again. Or you can trade it and get your money back. I mean, we, I mean, it's amazing, folks, how much money we can save you. And we don't just save you on the price. We don't have any extra dock fees, no prep fees, no dealer fees. You go to these other RV dealers, like I printed out right here, that's, that are 49.9, 47.9, 74.9. They all say plus tax, tag, title, dock fee, prep fee. Uh, these dealers charge you up to $2,000 in extra fees, and all those fees are 100% dealer profit. The only fee besides the sales price that you are required to pay on any new or used RV is if you buy in the same state that you live in, like if you live in Georgia and you buy from us since we're a Georgia dealer, you'll pay sales tax and the sales price. That's it. If you pay a dime over those two things, you just got ripped off. And these other dealers charge you up to $2,000 in fees on top of their prices that are over twice as high as ours in some cases. And all those fees they're charging you are 100% dealer profit, completely unnecessary to purchase a used or new RV. So don't fall victim to that big dealer fee scam. Another thing big dealers do is they have commissioned salespeople and that costs you thousands of dollars because they have commissioned salespeople. And I'll tell you why. Other RV dealers hire commissioned salespeople because this allows them to keep a large sales staff without having to pay them salary or pay them by the hour like we pay our salespeople. And this allows them to keep 40, 50, 100, however many salespeople they want because they only get paid when they sell something. So what happens is 
when you come into one of these big high pressure lots you can't just get out and look at their RVs they're all locked up behind a locked in fence you can't go to them without getting a salesperson assigned to you and in many cases they actually require you to get pre-approved for financing before they even let you set foot on the sales lot and um, folks that's wrong because here you can drive right up the RV you want to look at the price is on the windshield they're open you don't have to talk to anybody if you don't want to you can look all you want and you just make yourself at home here but when you talk to these commission salespeople that you get assigned to folks they get paid 25 percent of the gross profit of the deal so that means the dealers that's one reason why other dealers are so much more expensive than us because they got to mark their units up 25 percent more to pay their commission salespeople because they're not willing to pay them salary or by the hour that costs you more for the rv because they have to cover 25 percent of the salesperson's commission another disadvantage to that that salesperson that you think is your buddy they're strictly in there for their own benefit they're not there for the dealer's benefit they're not looking out for your benefit they're there for their own they want to sell you the unit that has the highest markup doesn't matter if it's the one you want they want to see the one that has the highest dealer markup because they can make the most commission on it and when it comes time to negotiate folks they're going to not want to deal with you because every dollar they knock off the price that's 25 cents less in their pocket if you have a trade-in they get paid commission on how far under market value that they can get you to give up your trade-in for it's just not the way you buy rv and that's why they have so much pressure when you go to these other rv dealerships they have another salesperson they'll partner up with and do what they call to's or turnovers and back and forth they just keep putting the pressure on you because the last thing a commission salesperson wants to hear is that you're just looking that you're not going to be ready to buy for a few weeks a few months or even a few years because they're going to do everything they can to pressure you into buying that day and that's that's not how you buy rvs folks we've been doing this for almost half a century we've never had commission salespeople. we never will all my salespeople get paid salary so this means they're strictly here for your benefit they get no incentive to sell in other words it, they get paid the same if they sell zero rvs or if they sell 20 rvs in a week so if you buy one from them or buy one from somebody else here or even buy one from another dealer it's all the same to them they get paid the same they're here to answer your questions and the logic behind that is simple when you have the lowest prices on the internet like i just proven on quality used rvs like we do you don't have to pay people to sell rvs they sell themselves no extra fees i have no finance or f and i managers that's another huge advantage too that costs you thousands of dollars when you buy from other rv dealerships a finance manager or f and i manager doesn't get paid by the hour or paid salary they're just like a commission salesperson they get paid a percentage of how much money they make the dealership after you make a deal with the salesperson the way they do that is through financing what they do is they'll get you approved at a very low rate but they never tell you the rates because they if they tell you a rate before you apply for financing then there's no way they can make money off of you but what they will do is they'll get you approved and i'm just throwing out numbers for an example two and a half percent and they'll get you approved at two and a half but they bring in your contracts mr customer congratulations six and a half percent interest rates this rv is yours sign here here and here and you own it well guess what when you figure four percent markup on a 50 to seventy five thousand dollar motorhome at other dealers that you can buy here for 39.9 but anyway uh when you look at that four percent interest rate markup that's going to cost you thousands of dollars over over time on a higher rv payments than you would have paid if you just came here we can give you 60 months at two and a half percent with approved credit we can get you up to 144 months at around four to five percent depending on your credit interest rate with zero dealer interest rate markup in other words the lowest possible interest rate that we can get you approved for is what you pay and we offer financing as a courtesy to our customers not as a way to exploit them like other rv dealerships folks 47 years family owned and operated is pretty much a true testament to what we do here uh, we want your repeat business we want your friends and family to come here on your referral to buy rvs from us because you save so much money we offer nationwide delivery at cost and we just charge you whatever it costs us to bring it to you get a driver home i've got five drivers and i've got one guy on his way to northern california right now as we speak delivering an rv 
I don't care how far away you live from us, chances are there's somebody within an hour or two of where you live that has purchased an RV from Parkway RV Center in the past. Uh, you know, we are just, we're one of the best in the business. We sell over 500 a year, and you just cannot beat our prices. Thank you for watching my video. I know it's been a long one, but, you know, you're welcome to call us at 706-965-7929. I even have an after-hours sales number, and all I ask is that you only call that number after 6 o'clock Eastern Time and only on Sundays because he has it off during the day and you can't really reach him. But you can reach after-hours sales at 423-605-6747. You can email us sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. And you can also check out our website, parkwayrvcenter.com. We've got over 150 used RVs in stock more arriving every single day. I mean, we sell 15 to 20 a week and we buy 15 to 20 a week. So our inventory changes. This particular unit, I believe, will be gone in the next 72 hours. I could be wrong, but usually when I make these predictions, they're normally right. And, um, and I believe this one right here for 39.9 is going to make somebody a fine motor home and save them a lot of money. Uh, if you want to email me directly, now I'm not in sales, so if you just have general questions about the brands, the RV lifestyle, I've been doing this for over 20 years. I've got over 100,000 miles logged driving and hauling fifth wheels and motor homes all over the United States, and I've worked on them since I was a teenager. So if you've got general questions, feel free to email me directly, bo, B-O, at parkwayrvcenter.com. Be glad to help you out. Any suggestions or comments, you're also welcome to email them to me. Thank you for watching my video. Let us know if we can help and please call us because we have a lot of inventory that I haven't had a chance to post online yet. Hope to see you soon.